What's up kids? Welcome back to the channel. It's day one. We got a light bulb out. I'm gonna fix that real quick. I think I hope. I look rough, man. Hold on a second, I gotta find a light bulb. <laughs> we got a light bulb. It's dark in here. I don't know what happened. The light was just flickering. But uh, we're gonna go through today um, the challenge that we're doing now. We need some light in here first. That's uh, not going on. It's supposed to just screw right in, aren't it? Hold on a sec. What's going on here? It made in USA. We're about to have light. Oh, there it is. There it is. Now we have light. All right. So um, yeah. Um, the new challenge. Uh, I'm going to show you guys everything I eat and whatnot, so give me a second so I get a pan set up. Hold on. Right there. We got our pan. Wanna come with me real quick? I'm going to come over here. Look at my refrigerator. Look at the refrigerator awesome. And 1939 GE. Badass. That ain't closed. I got to close that. Hold on. These things right here, Brussels sprouts. Some of my favorite things in the whole world. Let me show you how to, how to cook these things. Just turn that to high. I'm not gonna eat all these today, but I'm gonna make half of them. I'm gonna put them in a little bowl. And that's uh, one of the little snacks we could enjoy. Be right back when they're done. In the meantime, um, while those Brussels sprouts are cooking, this right here, this, see this? this little bag of radishes. One of my favorite little snacks. I know I look a little rough right now, you know, in between jobs. So, uh, appearance doesn't really matter too much. <clears throat> I'm always in between jobs down here in Florida. Ooh, look at that a little st stringy. Huh. I don't eat those, I just bite them off. Throw that in the garbage. The fucking Brussels sprouts are going to taste amazing. Part of my French. These, oh yeah, these is. I eat these. It's raw like that. They're, um, they speed up like uh, your digestion or something. I, don't know. I like them. Boss lady thinks I'm disgusting. Maybe I should shave. I think the Browns are playing today. I'm making Brussels sprouts. Eating radishes. Um, I don't know what we're having for lunch. She wants me to decide. But uh, when I get there, you can see what I have for lunch. One of these days, uh, I'm gonna do that McDonald's challenge this month. Probably at the end of the month because I don't want to eat any fried foods this week, this month. Not this week, this month. No fried foods at all. Oh my god. You guys see this thing I do also? It's freaking disgusting. I'll probably die. Mom, I'm gonna do it for you. But you wanna see it, right? I'm gonna catch my freaking tripod on fire. Hold on a second. This thing's all jacked up. So, I don't, um, metabolize food well. I'm not open that one at home.
and uh, I'm about to melt my freaking tripod. So, all right, cinnamon, it's backwards. But the camera works, I can't fix it. I could fix it, but I don't want to. But, if you're like me and you don't metabolize your foods very well, you need to take this stuff. It barely fits. Mm, scoop of cinnamon. Are you supposed to like mix it with honey or whatever? I don't want to mix it with honey. Oh, Brussels sprouts are so good. Mm. And you're only supposed to broil Brussels sprouts for like six minutes. I'm on like the three minute mark. Oh. I can just take a spoonful of cinnamon. I think it'd be a lot easier if I could like do the cinnamon sticks. What? Take a spoonful of cinnamon. Oh, we're gonna check out these Brussels sprouts. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cinnamon cough. And I just, uh, a little salt in there, not much. And, uh, boil them for about six minutes. Let them cool. Put them in a bowl. And I just snack on them. That's what I do. No canned foods this month. Well, tuna. And pineapple. That's about it. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna finish our uh, Brussels sprouts and. I'm gonna head out to lunch. We'll see you in a few minutes. Alright, the process spouts are about done. They are done. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. I'm this shirt. True story about this shirt. Um, four and a half years ago when I moved down here, uh, went to this, uh, went on a boat. Only a few times we went on a boat out down here. And, um, Got my other shirt like all wet, all fishy and stuff. It smelled. We were at this little restaurant, and um, <coughs> my shirt smelled. I walked in this gift shop at the restaurant, and I needed a shirt. And I was staying there for like ten minutes, maybe fifteen. I don't know. They were in there forever, and you know, I put the shirt on. I was like, I'm getting this shirt. And I figured uh, nobody's here. So I walked out to my table. I sat down and ate my food. And I, I think I even told the waitress, I said, hey, there's nobody in the gift shop. You know, I got the shirt in there. Put this on the bill too. <coughs> and she didn't. Um, but, uh, so yeah. Yeah. I got up from eating and I walked up with a shirt on. You know, so that's how I got the shirt. Look at this. Oh my God. I'm just going to burn my fucking face off. They're like little cabbages. A lot of people like, like cheese on them. I, I like them deep fried, but I'm not eating any fried foods this month. So, I'm going to burn my face off because I love these things. And I, I can't wait. That's hot. That's really hot. I'm, oh my God, so hot. <sighs> Fuck, that's hot. That's so good. Oh my God. All right. Boss is about another shower. I'm fucking hot. I'm gonna go get some lunch. I'll be back with you in a little bit. I love you guys. Later. Say hi, baby. Say hi. It's loud in here. But we're at a place called Slice. Thank you. And uh, it's like brunch time yet. Slice the pizza joint. It's yummy. It's very. And uh, we're starting with these uh, um, garlic knots with sausage gravy on them. And then I'm going to get me a, a tiny little pizza. 
It is one that's got all this great crap on it. It's called the sunburn. Yeah, hot. How do you pronounce that word? Soprasada? Anguilly sausage. Hot Italian sauce, spicy pepper jack. What did you say? Spicy yeah, pepper jack. Thank Perfect, thank you. thanks, Steve. Jalapenos, green olives, serrano chilies, and green onions. This thing's gonna make me poop like crazy. Baby. I want everything. You get everything. Hold that for a second. And then you go like that, and you slow it down. Show them my uh, What am I doing? You guys want some more time on the rocks? Yeah. I'm here all day to take this out. I don't know what I'm doing. I wasn't even working. It's so loud in here, so uh, we're going to get our food ordered. We're going to watch the Browns get their dicks kicked in. Uh, we'll talk to you later when the pizza comes out. I'm only eating the pizza, and then uh, that'll be done eating for the day. And we'll do it all over again tomorrow. Alright, that's it kids. It's time to eat some food. Sorry if that last part of the video was a little loud. It gets loud in that restaurant. Um, but we're done for the day. Um, it's, you know, a lot of food to eat. I normally eat under um, 2,000 calories a day for sure. But I had actual soda today. Um, probably close to 2,300 calories, but like I say, I'm going for 7,000 calories in a week. Um, I'm thinking about fasting tomorrow because there's a place on Thursdays that has all you can eat ribs. So I might be going to doing that on Thursday. And you guys will see how many ribs I can eat. But um, yeah, we're pretty much, you know, we're going to. This video is a little longer than what the rest of them be, but it's because it's an intro video. But what we're going to try and do is, uh, is they shoot for 7,000 calories in a week. And. Um, by doing that, I'm already eliminating 7,000 calories in a week, which is a loss of 2 pounds. And instead of walking 10,000 steps, I'm going to shoot for um, 20,000, which is 1,000 calories a day. Um, 7 days, 7,000, so another 2 pounds. So I'm trying to realistically lose about 4 pounds a week. You know, so, and I'm not going to lie, um, after I ate from the 168 day fast, like weight came back on real quick. So I'm right around... Uh, well, 192 or so. So, you know, I'm still down 12 pounds. But I'm hoping uh, that, you know, in a week, be at 188, then 184, then 180, then 176 by the end of October. Um, I did go out and drink last night for the first time in a while, so that's why the beginning of this video was rough, very rough. Um, and I'm doing uh, uh, Sober October, so I won't be drinking at all this, this month. So yeah, we're um we're gonna be hitting the gym a lot more. Uh, now I'm consuming more calories, but we'll push more weights. Their wrist is about um, by about 90%, I'm gonna say. So hopefully by beginning of November, then they'll really start doing you know 2,000 calories a day for sure, walking 20,000 steps, and really pushing the wrist a lot. And we'll get it you know very strong, you know, as strong as I could possibly get it. Get back out there and start golfing. Do a lot of fishing bring you guys some really really fun and interesting content uh thank you so much um for uh watching if you watched all the way through this part um if you haven't subscribed go ahead um the channel's new we're on our way to 75 subscribers that's pretty big for me i was at two subscribers for like forever then went to seven then now we're at 50 some so yeah i'm shooting to i want to be at like 100 by the end of the year so i think it's possible so if you haven't subscribed do that and uh, we will talk to you in the next few days. Like I say, I'm probably not going to eat tomorrow. If I do, it's just going to be little stuff. But then Thursday is going to be the day where you guys go watch me. You know, uh, have some fun. All right. Love you, kids. We'll talk to you later. Bye.